chapter 29, Mishnah 4. This Mishnah teaches, lists, this Mishnah lists things for which the length of the handle by which a utensil is held is three finger breaths. Three finger breaths. The port of a handheld goldsmith scale from which the balance beam with pans at either end is suspended, or the port of a handheld scale used by those who weigh fine purple wool from which the balance beam with pans at either end is suspended is part of the scale for the first three finger breaths. Anything more than that is not needed for the scale and is therefore not considered part of it. The Mishnah mentions another three finger breaths measure regarding a handle. The handle of a hatchet held with one hand that is beyond him, i.e. that sticks out below the hand of a person grasping the hatchet, is part of the hatchet up to three finger breaths below his grasp. Those extra three finger breaths help the person hold the handle firmly and are thus considered part of the handle. Anything beyond three finger breaths, however, is simply extra and not considered part of the hatchet. Rabbi Yossi says, even, uh, even though up to three finger breaths beyond the person's grasp, grasp is considered part of the hatchet, as the first time said, if the handle extends a tefach, four finger breaths or more beyond the person's hand, then the entire handle is tahor, not just the extra part. This is because a handle this long makes the hatchet unwieldy and difficult to use. It is thus not considered to be a proper handle altogether, and is therefore simply a plain wooden stick which is tahor.